So I share with you a physician's declaration developed by physicians in Puerto Rico that met together last week. And uh, I ask that you consider joining us in this declaration. We would very much appreciate support from the world and particularly from physicians. So I'm gonna read this declaration of the COVID summit in Rome, Italy. We, the physicians of the world, united and loyal to the Hippocratic Oath, recognizing the profession of medicine as we know it, is at a crossroad, are compelled to declare the following. Whereas, it is our utmost responsibility and duty to uphold and restore the dignity, integrity, art, and science of medicine. Whereas, there is an unprecedented assault on our ability to care for our patients. Whereas, public policy has chosen to ignore fundamental concepts of science, health, and wellness, instead embracing a one-size-fits-all treatment strategy which has led to more illness and death than the individualized, personalized approach to healthcare. Whereas, physicians and other healthcare providers working at the front lines, including those here, utilizing their knowledge of epidemiology, pathophysiology, and pharmacology, are often first to identify new, potentially life-saving treatments. Whereas, physicians are increasingly being discouraged from engaging in open professional discourse and the exchange of ideas about new and emerging diseases, not only endangering the essence of the medical profession, but more importantly, more tragically, the lives of our patients, you in the audience that are listening. Whereas thousands of physicians are being denied the right to provide treatment to their patients as a result of barriers put up by pharmacies, hospitals, and public health agencies, rendering the vast majority of healthcare providers helpless to protect their patients in the face of disease. Physicians are now advising their patients to simply go home, allowing the virus to incubate and the disease develop, and to return when their disease worsens, resulting in hundreds of thousands of unnecessary patient deaths due to failure to treat. Whereas the above is not medicine, it is not care. We cannot sit idle while patients are forced to go home and sicken in place. These policies may actually constitute crimes against humanity. Now, therefore, it is resolved that the physician-patient relationship must be restored. The very heart of medicine is this relationship which allows physicians to best understand their patients and their illness, to formulate treatments that give the best chance of success while the patient is an active participant in their care. Resolved that the political intrusion into the practice of medicine and the physician-patient relationship must end. Physicians and all healthcare providers must have the freedom to practice the art and science of medicine without fear of retribution, censorship, slander, or disciplinary action to include possible loss of licensure and hospital privileges, loss of insurance contracts, and interference from government entities and organizations, which further prevent us from caring for patients in need. More than ever, the right and ability to exchange objective scientific findings, which further our understanding of disease, must be protected. Resolved that physicians must defend their right to prescribe treatment, observing the first tenet, do no harm. Physicians shall not be restricted from prescribing safe and effective treatments. These restrictions continue to cause unnecessary sickness and death. The rights of patients, after being fully informed about the risks and benefits of each option, must be restored to receive those treatments. Resolved that we invite physicians of the world and all healthcare providers to join us in this noble cause as we endeavor to restore trust, integrity, and professionalism to the practice of medicine. Resolved that we invite the scientists of the world who are skilled in biomedical research and uphold the highest ethical and moral standards to insist on their ability to conduct and publish objective, empirical research without fear of reprisal upon their careers 
reputations, and livelihoods. Finally, resolved that we invite you, the patients, who believe in the importance of the physician-patient relationship and the ability to be active participants in their care, to demand access to science-based medical care. In witness thereof, the undersigned has signed this declaration as of the date first written. We invite all of you, physicians, scientists, patients, to join us in this resolution to protect the integrity of medical practice. Thank you.